new workforce. Now, let's tear this place apart. Bill, you go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Is there really anything for me to take at this point? Ooh, wait a minute. Canned vegetables. I'll take that. I'll take some crackers. A cigar for me to smoke. I have a lot of tobacco, so I can't really take that. Let me search in that chest over there. And I'll take cigarettes. I mean, I'm not going to use them, but whatever. Ooh, the dynamite's here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. I didn't know dynamite had to smell good, but okay. This is Lover of Ladies. Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. And I'm just scavenging at this point. Oh yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you boys. All of you. Sorry. That's who we are. Outlaws for life, fellas. Wait until we have John, Matt, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get cold, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, train robbery? Because, you know, consequences of our actions. But we're going to stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. All right. Dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. This is Lover of Ladies here. Like the video. Comment because I love talking to you guys. Definitely share my videos and most importantly, subscribe to my channel. Hello. You see that fella? Wasn't he at the camp with Cole? Leave him to me. All right, we're heading back. Just bring him back alive. It could be you. Okay. Bring him back alive. Chase down and lasso. Oh, this is sick. Okay. I mean, it's been a while since I've lassoed someone. Oh, wow. So, let's lasso this boy here. Ooh, yo, he fell from his horse. Okay. So, let me dismount. Oh, my goodness. This is funny. I love how this game teaches you how to hog tie someone. All right, so I'm a loot. See what he has. Okay, I'll take that. And also, you're coming with me, big boy. You're coming with me back to the camp. Yeah, I know. Oh well, get used to it. A storms are coming, I can tell. All right. I don't know. You don't know your name. It's Karen. Karen what? Duffy. Karen Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Karen Duffy. Where are you taking me? To camp. Where you ain't gonna lie. Why? What are you gonna do to me? So Make you talk. To save your breath for screaming. No, please. 
Wow, Arthur, you're savage for doing that. <laughs> he said, save your breath for screaming. I like that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use that. Now, I just love how suddenly it's all dark and windy and stormy here. Wow. And he actually listens. That's the funny part, too. Alright, let me just try and... Yeah, I thought I said for you to shut up. Damn, Arthur. And we're right here. Right at the ranch. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. I wonder what they're gonna do to him. Probably beat the shit out of the guy. Okay. And I got on that Arthur is pretty strong. Please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yeah. Yep. I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh no, now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson. Tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting, save fellas as need saving, and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. Thank you. Sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. I don't know. The last mission was so screwed up that people died. Do I really want to do another mission? I'm not sure, honestly. By the way, I love the music, honestly. So now that is over, let me go over to where it says P on my map. I have a good feeling that's another mission for me to do here. Ooh, are you good? Mm. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? Yeah, that's not a lot. I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. With seamen. Fortunately, Giggity. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. Damn, Arthur. Bill hunting and they what a savage. Well, that is more in the book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Thank you. Sorted, salted off. The hell is that? Would be preferable. Come it's on, that bad, huh? You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look at this game in those hills. I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? I need a shave, too. Come along. I don't know if I want him to cook my food if he's coughing up along like that, bro. Here, you 
you take this. Ooh. You you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. That's true. And, and also, run, doesn't the I bullet know. affect how the meat would taste too? Come on. Because of the Where's lead? It would make sense to do a bow and arrow because of the fact that it won't damage the meat and it won't alter the taste as much. I mean, that's just my theory. Yeah, we will. Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. Aw, I'm bonding with my horse. Right. That's so cute. Get stuck in the storm. Going out for John. That thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. No, you're doing enough. You're good. Just to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. I love how Arthur has so much blind loyalty to Dutch. And when I say blind loyalty, it's like low key looking at it from the outside perspective. Dutch is shady as hell. But since Arthur has been with him for so long and Arthur has so much history with him, it's like he sees Dutch with rose colored glasses because of that blind loyalty. And I believe looking back at it now, that is the downfall of just anything. Especially with what happened at the last mission. Obviously, we weren't there to witness it, but Dutch, he's not a saint. He's a hardcore sinner. Question is, what would it take for Arthur to realize that he's a hardcore sinner? And we'll both find out. We'll both find out as the series goes deeper and deeper. That's all I have to say. The water Stop is there. so beautiful Let's here. Why? What do you see? Uh, I'm so sorry for pushing you. Wait, do I need to get my bow? Recently. How can you tell? Yes, I'll take that. Let's walk it from here. Yep. Keep down. I... Move quietly and slowly. Okay. I am moving quietly and slowly. No. So. Oh, no, I do. I see it. Press L3 and R3. Ooh. Oh, wow. This is cool. I didn't know. But once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track the meal as well in grass and woods. This is dope. I like this. I didn't know I had the ability to track animals like that. Question is, can I track people this way too? Because if I can, that would be so cool, honestly. So the deer went this way, right? Let me see here. And I'm not able to track anything. Enable eagle eye and focus on the tracks to highlight them again. Your sentence also shown in eagle eye blowing in the direction of the wind. Animals will flee if they smell your scent, so remain downwind or far away when hunting. Okay. 
And Eagle Eye will be deactivated if you start running. Down there. You see him? Are you ready with that bow? I don't see shit. Oh. You can so. So aim for their neck. Shit. Shit. Fuck. I am so sorry. Oh shit. I did that? Okay, haunt another deer. Where is the other deer? I'm trying to figure out where's the other deer. And yes, that bow was too much to handle. So when you do shoot the bow, you best do it as soon as you draw. Because if you hold it out for too long like how I did, you start to lose your aim after a while. Wow, I did it. Thank you. All right. Oh, oh, I see it over there. I see it. Okay. This is going to be so fun. I can't wait to kill this one. Okay, I'm a crawl. Okay, I should be good. Oh shit. Uh, fuck. Okay. I'm sorry. This is just really hard for me to handle. I mean, we got one, so it's not too bad, right? All right, let me just crouch a little bit is that another deer damn that deer went away right okay oh shit oh shit damn I would be the one to fall I am so sorry. I am just an idiot. I'm just trying to shoot, honestly. Okay. Maybe this would help. Oh, shit. Fuck! I'm trying! <sighs> Can you stop pressuring me, please? How much meat do we need anyways? Is one deer not enough? All right. Oh, this is so frustrating. You know what? <laughs> fuck the bow and arrow. Seriously. Where the fuck are the deers? Okay, I hear the music. Done. Dun dun. But where's the deer? Ah, I got an arrow! Yay! No, but in all reality, though, let's focus on the trail. If I could get one deer, then I should be happy, right? Oh, man. Okay. I think I see one. Where are you going? Shit. The I am, asshole. Yes. Better go put it out of its misery. Oh, come on. You got it. Well done. Yes. That's all we can carry. I am so happy. Cool. You sure your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay. I'll go grab the other one. Where's my horse? <laughs> Let 
Where's my horse? Okay, okay, okay. The horse is like, dang it, I'm coming, I'm coming. Wow, that was intense. I thought I was going to be able to bring any food back at the camp. Right, I'm happy. Look at that. It took me how long? All right, let me get back to Charles here. I am so proud of myself. Look at that. This game has taught me how to hunt, how to kill. I feel like a man already. All right, let me see. Is he really able? Wow, he got it. Come on, man. Let's head back. Animal carcasses can be dropped off to person to contribute to gang supplies. Nice work, Arthur. Thank you. Meet here to keep us all fed for a few days. A few here days. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Thank you. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, so well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Yeah, it's getting too much. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. He's drinking. He's drinking his sorrows. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful. Was kind enough to what is that? I'm curious to see what is that. She has a wild look in her eye. Cause she lost her husband, bro. Of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but. That makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores of them for years. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Oh shit, bear. We can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. He must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. You know what? That's true. I'm not going to take the chance. We already got two game on our back. Take what you need, not what you want. The bear has spooked your horse. When a predator is nearby, your horse gets agitated. Hold L3 to calm it. Yeah, that's right, because if you don't uh, calm your horse, your horse gets so scared that it throws you off its back and rides away. Without you. Five, six months? <laughs> Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here. Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone. No problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. 
I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Yeah, he is. Dutch is certainly different. Yeah, he definitely care. is. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, Aww. We need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years? Something like that. 20 years? That makes sense as to why he's so loyal to Dutch. 20 years of his life. Oh my god, a father figure. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Wow, that makes so much sense. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. All right, we're back at the camp. Sweet. Just in time, too, of two nice deers in our backs. I'm just surprised that they're able to go out in the wind like that without any type of frostbite. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. Takes a lifetime of practice to master. Good haul, boy. All right, let's go to Peterson. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Okay. Is he still coughing in the corner back there? Well, well, well. <sighs> what a surprise. Find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? Feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy Moonshine, rum, I bet. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Navy rum? Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> you always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. See ya. Skin that one you, you dumped on the floor there. Cool. Oh, they're going to show how he skins it, too. The animations. Look at that. That's sick. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Let's make a good stew. Folk need it. Hell yeah, deer stew. I'll take some. This is Lover of Ladies, and thank you for watching my video. I'll see you next week.